remember off the top of my head. Okay, so they're keeping keeping easy Houston, and they're going with a Ganondorf and uh, Samus with Salutations and Dank. All right, let's see how this goes down. But it looks like already Houston decides that, you know what, I'm just going to go in with this Peach combo, take Ganondorf off stage, and <laughs> oh my god. And just get rid of Rob while I'm literally right at it because the Samus is literally just putting in work on easy. What happened? Does it, does it give Rob the time of the day to actually just land, just gets rid of him right, right when he can? Yeah, that's actually a very strong start. Now, I just mm -hmm. spent the first, like, three minutes hyping up easy in Houston, and they just lost their stock immediately. <laughs> so hey, that's not, not a very good start, but let's see if they can bring it back. I do, I do like how the fact that, you know, uh, salut salutations. Sorry, that's, a, that's such a tag. <laughs> I do like how salutations did give Easy like, you know, the runaround. Because, you know, he said, forget it. I'm going to get rid of Easy. He's looking for the threat, basically. And he gets, decides, you know what, if he's going to be such a huge threat to Ganondorf, I might as well get rid of him now. Mm -hmm. Having a hard time edge guarding salutations on the side there. Easy trying to get his revenge, but not quite. He's got another opportunity with the down throw up there. Not going to get anything, though. <laughs> just raw F smash. Man, Easy is not having a good time against this Ganondorf <laughs> right now. No, he's actually not having a good time in doubles so far. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I think Ganondorf, uh, he, while he does have his weaknesses, I think in doubles they do kind of get canceled out, especially if you have a good partner to be able to counteract those weaknesses. It looks like he's doing a good job right now. Only lost one stock so far compared to Easy's two, and um, Houston is close to losing his next stock and see why Ganondorf is trying to focus on Houston right here. Up there, yep, that'll take care of him here. Easy at least gets rid of Solidation stock here and as well as Dank at the same time here. Yeah, very good recognizing that Wizard's Foot only has one hitbox, so he just dropped shield, got that up smash and out of shield. He's going to be able to close out that stock. Mm, it looks like it's actually pretty much an even game. Uh, Easy's got to be a little bit careful. He's been losing his stocks relatively early, and Houston's about to lose his next one. If he can get this edge guard, he does not, though. Oh, I was going to say, watch yourself here, because you're, you're, you're <laughs> your teammate right behind you. And that up smash will definitely not only do damage to Easy, but also to your teammate. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Dank trying to go for an edge guard. I like the follow ups that these two have, though. You saw earlier they did a fair and then mm -hmm. got an up air afterwards. Ganondorf is really wide swinging hitboxes, so it's really easy to be able to catch his opponents as long as you're in the right positioning for it. Yeah. Easy at 138 alongside with Houston being at 139 here. At this point, it's going to be a pretty opportune opportunity here to actually get rid of Peach. Yeah, great recoveries from Dank, though. I love that he's delaying his recovery. He's just trying to get around that dare hitbox. It does come out really slowly, so you do have to kind of preemptively read how they're going to recover. So if you can delay it, then it gives them a lot more time to be able to recover back. And just like that, last stock situation for both Easy and Houston, but it can easily turn around. Yep, Salutation's going to lose that stock. So is Dank, and now we got a 2v1. <laughs> a character like Sam is not really the best at these times of comebacks. No, not at all. And originally, right, this was pretty much uh, Dank and Salutation's game to take, and then easily Easy and Houston were able to change things up into their favor, especially after forcing the share stock coming off from Easy. Looks like they were trying to get a ladder combo off the top. Easy not quite being able to finish it off, but the side B. Yep. Oh, yeah, they're just inches away from being able to get a Twitter clip, but not quite able to find it. But still, lost his jump, not going to be able to recover back. Easy and Houston with a pretty solid lead over at the end there. Yeah. That was good, too. The, the way that Houston and Easy were still able to hold it down, despite the fact that they were pretty much put on the back foot first over their opponents. So what's good here to see is how they're able to follow up against each other as well, because they're very well aware. Like, okay, hey, I'm being forced to share stock, meaning we have to kind of tie things up, especially with the last situation here. Yep. Now I can just imagine Salutations and Dank talking to each other. They're like, we need more Ganondorf jank to yes. happen right now. We need, we need more up smashes, more forward smashes, right? Yeah. And if we can land a Warlock punch, it doesn't matter if we lose. We landed the Warlock punch on stream. That's, so. the, that's the goal, right? That's yeah. the goal? It's yeah, because like, like, who cares about actual results? It's about the Twitter clips, man. It's your, personal, it's your personal challenge, right? How many Ganondorf Warlock punches can you land before you die? OK. We're going to a much wider stage the taller ceiling as well, so they're not quite going to be able to get those uh, early kills. I think they're a little bit scared of how easy and Houston were to be able to follow up each other off the top, so maybe yeah. they're just trying to keep itself a little bit safe and maybe keep a little bit more distance for Samus and Ganondorf to roam around. Yeah, and immediately right off the bat, too, we kind of saw how Salutations was trying to immediately take care of easy stock the same way he did first game. I kind of, I kind of want to see Houston at least try to cover Easy because it kind of seems like you know what they should be partner switching here at this point mm -hmm. because Easy has a little bit of a hard trouble but he doesn't have trouble here getting rid of Ganon via the up smash. Yeah, that was very scary. He was trying to get away from Houston, but then that moment Easy recognized, okay, I'm in a great place to cover a directional air dodge back. That will probably be the only thing that Houston can cover. So I'm just gonna charge his up smash and he's gonna go ahead and get that stock. All of a sudden, Salutations loses his next stock as well. So Easy and Houston are a pretty good spot right now.
All right, Dank with the white hitboxes, though. Ooh, Ooh. And that forward smash inches close away from Peach, only hitting the shield. Oh, that's do, probably a dead. No, never mind. I like that from Dank, though. He was trying to go off stage to try to cover uh, Houston, at least on the, on the way back. Back air. Oh, unfortunate. Just going to team combo his own opponent. He's not going to die quite yet, though. Ganondorf's still a heavy boy. Down throw. This oh, was yeah. a 2v1 situation here. That was really good. He doesn't have to try to edge guard Dank. He just knows, you know what, e Easy's uh, has the opponent. I need to go ahead and capitalize back here to get rid of Ganon from recovering. Yeah, Easy and Houston are doing a much better job at capitalizing both edge guards and team combos. Mm -hmm. That back air is going to be able to close out Easy's next stock. They got to get something crazy on Houston. Otherwise, I think this is pretty much a. Uh, I think it's curtains for Dank and Salutations at this point. Yeah. Yeah, especially with the way Easy's covering the edge guards here. They do have a pretty much an opponent switch here, so that's up to the salutation to actually figure out, okay, how am I going to get rid of this speech? He has the back air. He also has Dank off the stage. Both of these pretty much are fighting for the ledge to come back to sword center. Yeah, Easy's just covering the back, covering the rolls and the jumps around, and just like that. Oh, it actually looks like it's, uh, I think that might have been Rob's back air that actually killed Houston there. Oh, that was definitely not worth, unless, <laughs> unless Salutations really thinks he can do that. I mean, the one-on-one -on -one situation was 126, man. If there's anything that can be done for our salutations, it's getting the first few percent here. It starts up with the up air, immediately into the screw attack. Okay, now don't get me wrong. I think that oh, Samus actually does pretty well against Peach. I think he, she's a really good yes. character to deny Peach in the air, but the Samus has to be on point. But it looks like salutations is on point right now, taking him off stage. Can I mean, potentially get, the, get this next stock on an edge guard. Oh, but the Peach Bomb comes in. He set up one too many bomb bombs. <gasps> At that situation, he should have been looking to see how Houston was going to recover. Either he was going to go for an aerial, especially the way Peaches like to go for floats. Yeah, okay. We Lana. did see Quick versus Samsora give Samsora a lot of trouble yesterday. So that kind of just supplements the fact that Samus can do pretty well against Peach. Double jump out of forward there. Air. Another oh. forward air. He's got him, takes up him the off stage. stage. The missiles come in. The charge the shot. Okay, set up. Set up What's the ledge control? Down air. Takes him to the other side. Wait for the landing. Wait for the landing. Oh, he's trying to fight Samus. Oh! No, he jumped out. <laughs> He, so the problem here that I see from Salutations is like he sets up the bomb ball, but he set it up one too many times where he could be setting up for edge guards. And not only that, waiting to see how Peach is going to re react to the bomb balls. But unfortunately, uh, still really good 1v1 situation. Almost close to my favor. The last time he just decided to jump out. Yo, man, he was down 0 to 126. Yeah. And then he brought it all the way back. He almost had it. Yeah. Just unfortunately, Samus's movement is just a little bit too slow. So sometimes you can get caught like a sitting duck in the air. Yeah, you really the, need to be able the, to the utilize. Was, the crowd was really into it, too. They yeah. wanted to see the little bit of the Game 3 situation too, with, with the way how about that played out. Yeah. You so, really need to be able to utilize Samus's like, B-reverses and wave bounces mm -hmm. to be able to trip up your opponent do, to make up for Samus's slow movement in the air. So. Exactly. That's kind of why we see that character hasn't been buffed in movement at all, because as is the character as a package as a whole has already enough tools. You just have to learn how to utilize the toolkit. Yeah.